Hey, Sean, have you looked at the front door yet? You go. Pretty view, again. Yeah. All right, we arrived in Puerto Rico last night and I just wanted to say the level of service we've received, the way people have treated us is with a whole bunch of respect and patience and it's just been really, really nice. We've got the rental car, Kia Forte. Really excited to test out uh, the, the Kia brand. I've never driven a Kia before and uh, just been following their brand for a while and I'm excited to get a, feel, get a sense of how it drives and all that. Trying to get warmed up, get ready for the day. I'm charging all the stuff up and so I'm gonna to try to capture some stuff for you guys. I'm afraid to drop my phone when I want more of this. Yeah, it's this bitch. Hmm. I guess we can check out this. It's in old salon area. Which one? This one. A scambra. That's good for snorkeling. The best of the best trip planner Shuang. I planned everything. Where to eat lunch, where to eat dinner. What's there for to sightsee? What's the best place to snorkel in? What's the prettiest beach? Everything. Something. What made you want to go here? Because everybody go, it's clearly a big tourist spot. Okay. Yeah, and they use it as a defense, defense castle to fence off, I guess, Europeans. And it's really old, has history. Oh, I'm too hot. It's too hot. What do you have to say right now? Too hot. It's in the middle of the day, too hot. Yeah. What is it, the sun? Yeah.
This is a big one. And the wild parrot. This, it's called a coqui. That's the special frog in Puerto Rico. I'm not coqui. Forest of no return, the forest of no return. There's a bear there, there's a bear there. Schwang is leading the way, Schwang leads the way. Here are the frogs? Yeah. Mm -hmm. People come here, so it's probably weird. Mamosa, it's tough. It looks a tongue like a mamosa. Wow, good place. Oh. What does it mean? Cuida tu tierra. Cuida tu tierra. Cuida tu tierra. Cuida tu cuerpo. Te amo. Cuida tu tierra means take care of your earth. Take care of your earth. Take care of your island. Cuida tu, tu isla. Cuida tu cuerpo X. That would be sort of a, a progressive take care of your body. And then I love you. Okay, while we walk through the forest, Noah has to share his uh, philosophical opinion. Just some thoughts, essentially marking them down rather than. Uh, okay, never mind. It'll have to be later. <laughs> wow. You can do both sides.
just jump. Walking in downtown Rincon. Well, we got to our, our place here in Rincon and uh, it's Shuang's 29th birthday today. So I figured we should go out and check it out and went to this little place called uh, the Beer Company. It should be our background. Okay, we'll show the flowers. There's a place called Rincon Beer Company uh, that sometimes has live music, but tonight they were just playing some like downbeat stuff that it's not the right vibe there's some some place playing some samba but nothing live so we're just gonna walk around it's like a fishing village that's how it has started like tulum yeah just like tulum. in mexico but then it's a famous surfing destination okay it's known for big waves perfect for surfing it's fish like rock I figured uh, I'd wrap this up because I didn't do a lot of talking on any of the videos. It's mostly just been you getting to see, you know, just see what's here. And so while we're walking out on this crash boat beach, um, you know, right in here. Here, it's like so pretty. I think Over this, here. I think that this might be one of the prettiest the beach we have seen on this trip. It is trip. really pretty, yeah. It is like a really nice view. Even with, you know, sound not really out. It's like really nice. I think it has to do partly with just the weather. It was raining today, and so I think uh, it's got kind of a misty quality to the air. And the water all, ever since we've been here, has been this kind of milky... Uh, green, you know, a milky green and with a little bit of blue mixed in. It's a pretty big island and I just wanted to mention a couple things from this trip and just talk about a lot of the stuff, the places that we've been. Um, this, the crash boat beach, apparently in, in these areas there's boats that are have sunk down and if you swim down with some goggles or some snorkeling gear you can see, you know, the boats and you can see a bunch of fish that have made their homes in the boats. Um, and we can walk out over here. Like a flag. A big bird, yeah. A big bird. But yeah, basically, there's quite a bit of different this, places. This I'll take a look. This section of the video is getting long. If you're interested in, in visiting Puerto Rico, I say do it. If you're from uh, the US, you're, it's not necessarily going to feel like you're in another country. Uh, there's a ton of chains that are here, and so and and basically, you're not going to have a hard time finding anybody. Like, it seems like everyone's bilingual and and speaks English very well, so you're not going to have a problem communicating with anybody. And there's a lot of different cool places you can go. You can check out these uh, up on the hill. This must like, be the resort. area here. People talk about yeah. jumping. Yeah, which is, yeah, the water is like crystal clear. So yeah, I'll wrap it up by just saying uh, we, we visited a lot of cool places. There's a rainforest. Um, there's a river that has beautiful water that you can go swim in the river up in the rainforest. Um, 
a ton of different beaches. If you, if you rent a car, you can drive to tons of different parts of the island and it, it's kind of endless, all the unique beaches and um, unique vistas that are available. So it's a little bit expensive though. I would say that um, there's, if you're on a budget, there's less expensive places that you can go to. But yeah, it's a great place to go. We've had a good time. We got to celebrate Schwang's birthday yesterday. And um, today's our last day. I feel like the water here is as pretty as Turks, but only at this beach. Most of the places, Careful. the beach here, are, the water are not as pretty. So with that, we're headed to the airport tomorrow. So I think this will be the last video that I shoot. So thanks for checking out our, our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Look at this bird, it's Strong cute. and Noah's yeah. adventure in Puerto Rico. We'll see you guys later. Okay, you've had a pretty thorough experience of Puerto Rico Island. So, if anybody was going to travel here to Puerto Rico, or if anybody was thinking about traveling to Puerto Rico, what would you tell them? Do a longer trip. There is so much things to say. So, at least a week long trip. You think they should do it? They like driving around and exploring, yeah. Yeah, because there will be a lot of driving. It's a big island, and then all the different tourist stuff are all scattered around. <laughs> I had to dodge the water. How does your heart feel about Puerto Rico? It's, it's pretty. It's pretty. But the food comes in. All right, you heard it here first. Puerto Rico is pretty and the food cost is high. So if that sells you, then come on down here <laughs> to Puerto Rico. Cool. That's it for us. Thanks for tuning in to Schwang and Noah's Adventures. We will see you in the next one. <laughs>